Hey everyone, welcome to The Dev Life and I hope everyone is safe. Today we're going to be looking at classes. So this is an object-oriented programming concept. A class basically is a template for an object. You can assign it attributes as well as methods that define its behavior. You can instantiate an object through the class, the uh, init method, and interact with it uh, in your code. So I'm just going to create a class called cat here. This is the init method. And we're going to give it a name, color, and then we're going to create a method here, play sound. And we'll play meow for the cat sound. Let's import that class. From cat import cat, and we will let's get rid of this, and then we will <coughs> instantiate the class and assign it to this object. So Mr. Cat is equal to cat. You have to put those parentheses at the side of the class name in order to instantiate it. And here we're going to assign the color, the name. We'll just call it Mr. Cat and we'll play the sound. So we'll call the method play sound on that. Okay, and that's it. It'll, it it uh, plays the sound. So while well, actually it prints out the sound, um, let's print the rest of the attributes here. And you'd refer to the uh, attributes just like you did when you were assigning it above. If you wanted to access it, print it, overwrite it. So in this print statement, we're gonna say, you know, the cat Mr. Cat color is and then refer to that attribute and then it makes the sound and the next line has the sound on there. That's it. So that's it for working with classes. Good job guys. You successfully created a class. This is useful when you need to work with objects in your code. You can instantiate multiple instances and alter their values and interact with them through their methods. These actions might cause changes in a backend database, for example, and allows users to meaningfully interact with the data in order to bring about those backend updates. That's it for today. Stick about the channel and learn about concepts in development, coding, and much more. Please comment below if you have any suggestions for the content or any recommendations. I'd love to hear them. Hit that like button if you like what you saw and share it with others if you think that they'd enjoy, enjoy it or can learn from it. Do subscribe to The Dev Life and hit that little bell notification icon so that you can get updates as I release new videos. Thanks for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. We say goodbye. We all know that.